Welcome to the channel Jonas Studies IQ. Today in this video, I'll be discussing the current effects of 3rd July 2020, which will be useful for all competitive exams like SSC, PSC, Railways, Banking, etc. So keep watching, stay updated. Today's first question Which bank launched e Kishan Dhan app for farmers? This is HDFC Bank. HDFC Bank has launched e question than uh, than app for farmers uh, managing director of hdfc bank is aditya aditya puri aditya puri is the managing director of hdfc bank and the headquarter of hdfc bank is in mumbai question number 2 who has been appointed as its First female Lieutenant General of Pakistan Army. Uh, this is Nigar Juhar. Nigar Juhar has been appointed as the first female Lieutenant General of Pakistan Army. Uh, Prime Minister of Pakistan is Imran Khan. President is Arif Alvi. Arif Alvi is the President of Pakistan. Capital is Islamabad, currency is rupee. Pakistani rupee. Question number three Kerala has announced which project to rehabilitate the returning expatriates. This is Dream Kerala project. Dream Kerala project. Kerala has announced. Dream Kerala project to rehabilitate the returning expatriates. Chief Minister of Kerala is Pinarayi Bijayan and the Governor is Arif Muhammad Khan. Pinarayi Bijayan and the Governor is Arif Muhammad Khan. He is the Governor of Kerala. Question number 4. Who has been appointed as next ambassador and permanent representative of, of India to the United Nations and other international bodies in Geneva? This is Indira Mani, Indra Mani, sorry, Indra Mani Pandey. Indra Mani Pandey has been appointed as uh, next ambassador and permanent uh, permanent representative representative of India to the United Nations and other international bodies in Geneva. Question number 5 Who was named as India's most valuable player of the 21st century by wisdom? This is Ravindra Jadeja. Ravindra Jadeja was named as India's most valuable player of the 21st century by wisdom. Question number six. Who has been appointed as a new chief executive officer of Central Board of Film Certification? This is Ravinder Bhakar. Ravinder Bhakar has been appointed as the new chief executive officer of Central Board of Film Certification. Chairperson of Central Board of Film Certification is Prashun Joshi. Prashun Joshi. Is the uh, is the chairperson of Central Board of Film Certification and the headquarter is in Mumbai. Headquarter is in M Mumbai. Question number seven: Who has taken charge as the new chairman of Indian Oil Corporation? This is Srikant Madhav Baidya. Srikant Madhav Vidya has taken charge as the new chairman of Indian Oil. Indian Oil is headquartered at New Delhi. New Delhi and it was established in the year 1959. Question number 8. Which of the following launched Fathe Lagao Pariyavaran Vachao? Pariyavaran Vachao campaign. This is Delhi. Delhi has launched Fadhe Lagao Pariyavaran Bachao campaign. 
The campaign is to reduce air pollution by increasing the green cover. 31 lakh, 31 lakh saplings will be planted under the scheme. Question number 9. Which of the following approved a loan of 400 million US dollar for the rejuvenation of the Ganga River under the Namami Gange program of India? This is World Bank. World Bank has approved a loan of 400 million US dollar for the rejuvenation of the Ganga River. President of World Bank is David Malpass. David Malpass is the President of World Bank and the headquarters is in Washington. Recently, 77.95% of the Russian citizens voted in support of the amendments to the 1993 Constitution of Russia. According to the amendments, Vladimir Putin can lead Russia until which year? According to the amendments, uh, Vladimir Putin can lead Russia until 2036. Vladimir Putin's second consecutive term would have ended in 2024. 2024. But now with amendments, he can remain as president till 2036. Capital of Russia is Moscow, currency is ruble, and the parliament of Russia is called Duma. Duma. Question number 11. Who of the following has been honored as 2020 Great Immigrants by the Carnegie Corporation? This is Dr. Siddhartha Mukherjee and Professor Raj Chetty. So the correct answer will be both A and B. Every year since 2006, since 2006, ahead of Independence Day of the United States, on 4th July, Carnegie Corporation of New York honors the legacy of its founder Andrew Andrew Carnegie, who being an uh, immigrant from Scotland. He was a immigrant from Scotland, rose from poverty to become a leading industrialist. The awards are also to remind how immigrants have contributed to the greatness of United, uh, United States. Dr. Siddhartha Mukherjee chosen for the award for being a science communicator at the time of pandemic by making people educate about the virus, the importance of social distancing and wearing masks through his essays, social media accounts and media interviews. And Raj, Professor Raj Chetty chosen for his efforts in launching a real-time economic impact monitor of COVID-19. Question number 12. Which of the following launched Accelerate Vegan campaign? Accelerate Vegan campaign has been launched by Science and Engineering Research Board. It works under Department of Science and Technology. Department of Science and Technology. The scheme was launched to provide a single platform that will encourage high-end scientific research in the country and uh, internships and capacity building program, uh, program for research scholars and students will be provided. Question number 13. Who has been appointed India's next High Commissioner to Sierra Leone? This is Rakesh Kumar Arora. Rakesh Kumar Arora has been appointed India's next High Commissioner to Sierra Leone. Capital of Sierra Leone is Freetown. Free Town is the capital of Sierra Leone and the currency is Leone. Shalma Lakhari has made history 
upon her appointment as the lieutenant governor of which province of Canada? This is Alberta. Salma Lakari has been appointed as the lieutenant governor of uh, the of the province of Alberta. Uh, Prime Minister of Canada is Justin uh, Trudeau. Justin. Trudeau is the Prime Minister of Canada and the capital is Ottawa. Ottawa. Ottawa is the capital of Canada and the currency is dollar. In July 2020, the center has declared which state as a disturbed area for further period of six months till December 2020. Nagaland has been uh, declared as a, as a disturbed area for further period of six months till December 2020. Question number 16. In July 2020, the Union government has launched the special liquidity scheme for how many rupees to improve a liquidity position for non-banking finance companies and housing finance companies. This is third rupee, uh, rupees thirty thousand crore. Uh, so the, uh, the union government has launched a special liquidity scheme for thirty thousand uh, rupees, uh, thirty thousand crore rupees for non-banking finance companies and housing finance companies. The scheme was launched on 1st of July, 1st of July 2020. RBI will provide funds for the scheme. Question number 17. Recently, Shashank Manohar stepped down as ICC chairman who will be the interim head the interim head will be Imran Khwaja Imran Khwaja he is the former president of Singapore Cricket Association Manohar was appointed uh, Manohar was appointed as the first independent chairman of International Cricket Council in May 2016 2016 Danukunda Jethi Prakash and Tujum Vasher has uh, answered correctly for the question of uh, 2nd July 2020. Uh, this is a question for you. Who has been appointed as a Director General of the Indian Institute of Mass Communication? You have to answer the question in the comment box. So, this is the end of the video. Thank you for watching. Have a good day.